Hi, it's Becca from the Alameda Park Zoo Education Center in beautiful Alamogordo, New Mexico. Today, I'm going to talk about the ball python. It's Python regius, that is a, uh, the scientific name, and it is actually the subspecies of the royal ball python. They are on the concern list for the IUCN. Since it is on the threatened list, the reason is it's from Central America and the meat there is prime, so it is threatened by hunters as well as the pet trade. Uh, they're very, very popular as pets. Let's talk about their feeding habits and their prey. When they're under 28 inches, they feed primarily on nestling birds, and when they're over 28 inches, they go out and actually hunt mammals and rodents. The local species that were captive and sold as pet store uh, animals have actually survived for 40 years. The oldest one is 47 years old. The ball python is very popular because, and as far as growing, it usually gets approximately five feet. There have been some a little larger and some a little smaller, but they are a smaller breed python. Another reason why they're very popular is they're a constrictor, so they're not very dangerous. They bite on occasion uh, as far as feeding. They're not aggressive feeders. Some have to be hand fed when they're first imported in. So they are a very safe snake. Of course, small mammals may be in danger. They are constrictors. Let's talk about the fun fact of the ball python. The fun fact about them is they have different variations and color patterns. There's even one that's called the tiger ball python. They're beautiful. Thank you for watching. Thank you for your comments, El Magordo and El Paso and all the other vicinities. Thank you for your support. If you have any comments, go to Facebook and be watching us. Bye.